things that you'll need. Masking tape. A corn pad. And some colored tape cut up. And also pinstripe tape from Pet Boys. The pinky, this is the where the pinky goes, okay? This goes. Just brush this. Usually it just goes right above where this black the black part of the frog. So you just put the hole at the edge of that. I think that works. Yeah, that's a good spot for me. Okay. The way that you can tell is if you put your your ring finger on this little dot, put that and then see where your pinky goes. Okay. And then put it at the top. Okay. And then bend it down. And then I have these really thin tapes. These are actually from the, um, the pet boys. And these are like paint stripes, but you can cut pieces of colored tape and um, use that. This holds it down because the corn um, pad does not like to stay. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the bottom. I start at the bottom on the pearly part, and then I bring it all the way over as far as it goes. Okay. And then it sticks at the bottom like that okay and then on the pinky part on the other side of the corn pad I have a smaller one and then I wrap that around okay so start at the middle this guy and then I flip it over just wrap it around okay so that it's secure and it won't move and that's where my pinky goes okay now the masking tape is for these guys right here the three fours so what I do is I take the side this is sticky on both sides right here is not sticky because there's another piece of tape so I just put that part over the pearl and then I wrap it around so that the sticky part goes on the part that faces me okay and if you want the measurements, there's, you know, it's just by eyeball. Um, okay, and I bring it, I try to fit it to see how tight. For kids, you want it tighter, okay, so that you might have to bring it into the whole part, but just do the best you can. Okay, and then you tighten it right there, okay, you tape it down, so then you've got When we do these exercises, you want to look at the thumb, you want to look at the pinky, you want to look at your first finger to make sure there's no gripping, okay? Make sure this one's curved, make sure this one's curved, okay? And make sure this one's relaxed, all right? So watch your fingers when you do these exercises. Up like a rocket, down like the rain, Side to side like a choo-choo train. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, now we're going to go over the elf song. So the elf song um, calls on every string. Okay, so let's look at our violin. I'm gonna put it up. So the one that is in front of you, okay, is the E string, okay? The next one is the A string. After that, it's the D string. And then the one on your back is the G string, okay? So this song incorporates the strings, okay? And you have to pluck with your pinky because your pinky is the weakest finger, so it strengthens your pinky. And it also, because we're up here, it also helps us keep this nice shape of our um, violin finger fingers. Okay, so let's start with this exercise. So we tap. Don't forget we're gonna tap, okay? Donuts, 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 donuts. 
out in front of you look at yourself in the back flip it over look for the button fly it into your neck here we go donuts 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 okay now let's start our song okay elves for e arc for a and ducks for D, and glob for G, okay? Elves, 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 flying in the ark, 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 passing by the ducks, 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 landing on the glob, glob, glob. Okay, and then you do your donuts, 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 donuts. donuts. Donuts, 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 okay? And then bring it back. Okay, let's do it again. Donuts, 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 donuts. Okay, grab your violin. Look at yourself in the back. Look for the button. Donuts, 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 donuts. Okay, start with the E again. notice that I start tapping first and then I go like this you know or I go like this first and then I do this it doesn't matter okay you just do whatever is comfortable or what you feel like doing at that time okay so I want you to repeat this exercise five times okay so that your PT will get stronger all right thank you Put your three, four, put it into the cradle. Okay, and then put your pinky on top and put your thumb at the bottom. Okay, and then rest your first finger. Okay, so you're gonna go like this. Pepperoni pizza, pepperoni pizza. Okay, practice a little bit on your shoulder. Pepperoni pizza, pepperoni pizza. Okay, the key here is that you only want to use as much as this yellow. So that's a very minimal amount of bow. Okay, don't go red to red. You just want to go to the yellow. You want to use the yellow. Okay, so practice on your shoulder again. Pepperoni pizza, pepperoni pizza, pepperoni pizza, pepperoni pizza. Okay great now let's pick okay slide back and forth do pepperoni pizza pepperoni pizza then do pepperoni pizza pepperoni pizza hold the violin look at yourself in the mirror flip it over watch the button fly it into your neck and here pepperoni pizza Pepperoni pizza, then tap your high dot. Pepperoni pizza, pepperoni pizza. Okay, so what you're gonna do is you're just gonna play the A and the E with pepperoni pizza using your bow, okay? You're gonna do it five times. Just doing the yellow part. Pepperoni. 
Slide back and forth. One. Pepperoni pizza. Pepperoni pizza. Okay, and then slide, slide here. Take your bow off. Okay. And then put it back in rest position. <laughs>